Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Emilicious. Yes, you can see it. Okay, we're doing another challenge and it's called the Vampire Legacy Challenge. Oh my god. It's so funny that this challenge just came out now because I've been thinking about doing a gameplay with a vampire. So this is like perfect timing because I have not used that pack although I own it so I figured you know this will be perfect for me to use my vampire pack and just try to vampire legacy challenge now there are a lot of rules um for this challenge um I mean I was just reading this and I was just like wait what do you want me to do now <laughs> but it seems like it's a fun challenge so um I'm not going to read all the rules to you guys now because it's just so many, but I'll have a link to um, this page where you can find all the rules if you're interested in trying this challenge. Well, before I get started, welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. I'm Smilicious. I post videos about The Sims 4, The Sims 3, and Paralives. So today we're playing a Vampire Legacy Challenge. If you've have not heard about this challenge it will be in the description box so I just want to take a few seconds to welcome you and um, make sure that if you like this video give me the thumbs up and if you have not done it yet make sure you click on subscribe and hit the notification bell that way every time I post get a notification all right so for this gameplay i have decided that i was going to play it in forgotten hollow of course it makes sense because that is the world that came with um the vampire expansion pack or game pack um, with the sims 4. so this is the world we're playing in now um i didn't see any rules that says you cannot jump between worlds so we can always you know jump between worlds and do what we have to do now the kicker okay for my vampire diaries fans out there because i'm a super huge fan of vampire diaries i love 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 that show so i decided why not you know bring the vampire diaries character here and have some fun right so um i went in the gallery and i did download the vampire diaries uh, characters not all of them but most of them at least the most uh, the ones that i really liked and i felt like were part of the big story duh so i did download them from the gallery so don't think that i was so great at creating those sims because no i am not that great okay <laughs> but i did get them from the gallery so if you are interested in playing with the vampire diaries um characters go into the library start searching because you will have a lot of options i tell you so um yeah just to give you a quick overview here so we have the originals there okay now don't get too excited it's not all the originals that are there so we only have klaus and his sister rebecca okay i try to get um elijah because i felt like elijah was a big part of the vampire diaries as well but 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 guys um the, i couldn't find elijah that looked like elijah that i was satisfied with so um yeah no elijah guys but we can always add them later you know as the story progresses you know we can always bring elijah let's see where this takes us okay but so far we only have uh klaus and um rebecca now um there are other two vampires there there was the original vampire that was part of this household so i just left them there and then we have another vampire just because you know i didn't want it to be like okay only two vampires in there you know what i mean um so this is a totally vampire household okay and uh here we have the friends okay in the friends guys yay <laughs> so in the friends i'm so excited because we have of course elena gilbert and her brother um jeremy i was like wait what <laughs> so we have elena and her brother jeremy gilbert and then we have of course bonnie bennett because she's going to be the witch yay so we have bonnie bennett and we have um matt donovan and we also have tyler yeah lockwood so i figured these were enough right yeah so this lot is just for townies they're like random sims there um i you know because i didn't want the story to just be around them i mean there were also other random people um in the vampire diary so this household is just random you know townies and here we have the salvators yay of course we have stefan and damon salvator and then um yes i chose caroline to be my first feeder because you know if you guys remember the story of vampire diaries when it started um damon is the one that started he came to town and um and yeah he um 
he met Caroline and he was like compelling her to forget and he was feeding on her blood. So I figured why not start that same way and then hey, this is not going to be the Vampire Diaries, okay? So for people that are going to be super excited, yeah, like, there will be variations. I'm not going to do it exactly like the Vampire Diaries. The things are going to change depending on what happens in the game, right? You never know. But uh, I just wanted to use the characters to give that Vampire vi Diaries um, vibe to it. But it's not going to be exactly Vampire Diaries. But very similar, okay? And here, of course, guys, we have the grill. There's no Vampire Diaries with Without the grill okay the grill was the hangout spot that's where everybody was just going to hang out now don't get me wrong this is a little fancier than the grill that was in vampire diaries but i just wanted something to like you know a hangout spot where everybody goes okay we'll play with the salvators and that would be my you know my base my first vampire i guess household so we're playing with them now i'm still debating i'm i'm still thinking right now should i start with stefan or should i play with damon right as the main uh, vampire but i think i'll go with damon just because you know i feel like i won't i won't feel too sad if damon does like mean things you know what i mean <laughs> because it's damon um Stefan is always like, oh, the nice guy. It would break my heart if I have to make Stefan do something wrong. You know what I mean? Like, it's Stefan. Come on, it's Stefan. All right, so um, again, disclaimers here. I did download this house from the gallery, okay? It's not my build. I cannot do things like this. So <laughs> it's from the gallery. And the reason why I picked this home, it's because in the back here this was meant to be a vampire's home and they already have the plasma fruit so um i didn't want a situation where they have absolutely have to feed right on people um they can choose to not feed and use the plasma fruit now i don't know if that's cheating with the game i don't remember seeing anywhere in the challenge that you cannot use the plasma fruit so it is monday it is super late at night so i think it's perfect for damon to just like you know be out there and terrorize the town okay mystic falls here we come okay forgotten hollow okay i know we're not in mystic falls but let's pretend for a second that we are in mystic falls okay